welcome to another QIS video on child well-being. Our focus is on development and the empowerment of children. One aspect of that is education. Education is the opportunity that children are given to dream, to learn, to grow and to thrive in their families, communities and even beyond. Education involves instruction and the formation of manners in a child, the enabling and the understanding, and the chance to be exposed to all instruction, forming a child's manner in preparation for that good work that they are prepared by God in advance to do. Every organization should encourage opportunities for education for all children, including those with special needs and with disabilities not just in a classroom setting, but in the outdoors, through play, and through relationships as well. A curriculum that puts in mind the personal, social, and emotional health education for children is important. Organizations should encourage multi-agency working approach where children's needs are assessed and are referenced by different people to get a better understanding of the children's needs and not just working on assumptions. Children learn through, amongst other things, play. They learn through observation, experimenting, creating, and even participation. Play. Children should be given as many opportunities to play as possible. There should be enough play space for children. The play spaces should be safe they should be able to play board games and even be part of sports as well. Observation. Children should be taken to visit different sites and places in the community and the city and to allow them the opportunity to experience those things. Spend time talking about those places that are important and why. Give them an opportunity to express themselves through drawing, through writing, part of their visits. Creating. Learning can be done through reading and especially allowing children to be creative in the way that they read and that they write. Establish and create fun ways of engagement in reading through various reading materials. Tell them stories. Allow them to create stories as well amongst other things. Experimenting. Find out what happens when children go out and play with water. Allow them that experience, mix colors, or even make sounds using various objects and things. Participation, let the children teach one another. Encourage them to be part of the planning process of the organization's activities. Involve them in activities at home so they can also learn to be responsible and to appreciate the resources that they use. Children will then be better prepared to serve the Lord well.